Good evening, everyone, and thank you for joining us. A bill that would legalize marijuana for medicinal use had its day on the floor today. Lawmakers debated whether or not it's a good idea for the state of Nebraska. Channel 8 Eyewitness News reporter Joe Harris has more in tonight's top story. Joe? Rod and Megan, debate, debate on this continued late tonight. Supporters say it's a good alternative for pain and health problems, but that doesn't stop others from saying it's dangerous. Dominic Gillen says his son William suffers from a seizure disorder. It's very treatment resistant uh, and he suffers from 100 or more seizures every day. On Wednesday, he showed up to the Capitol in support of Senator Anna Wishart's bill that would legalize medical marijuana. Wishart says it could be used to treat chronic health problems and pain. Gillen says if passed, it would give them the opportunity to see what impact medical marijuana would have on William. If it reduces his 100 to 150 seizures a day to, I mean, incrementally, then it was, it's definitely a benefit to him and it's in his quality of life. It faces opposition, though. Some senators cited concerns over Colorado's road safety after it legalized medical marijuana. The year after they approved medical marijuana was the highest year in fatalities on Colorado highways. So don't tell me that marijuana doesn't kill people. Senator Sue Crawford proposed an amendment that would remove edibles from the list of cannabis products the bill would allow. Edibles that are in the form of candy, cookies, that could easily be ingested by a juvenile, juvenile um, and may be more attractive to youth. If passed, Nebraska could join 33 other states that have some form of medical marijuana use. Now, lawmakers did not vote on it tonight. Now, even if this does not pass in the legislature, some are working on a ballot measure that would put legalize, legalizing medical marijuana on the 2020 election ballot. Joe Harris with our top story tonight. Thank you, Joe.